Literally married and divorced in the same day. I was like, oh my god. Oh. I packed all those shoes for a reason. No, sweet, I don't Guys, come back to she took all my shoes out of my backpack to pack her little bags in her shoes. Yes. And this. Why no do you need that? No sacks, no sacks. You know how much you had in the green bag. Oh my god. I don't know which one you let me bring. No, I swear, those can't be the only ones. Which one did you bring? Ninguno foto. Una bota blanca. My comfort? Mom, you're joking. Los comfort negros no los trae. Okay, I don't care about those. Bueno, los blancos si están aquí. What about my other um, sandals? You're going to tell me, bring your fancy shoes. You better not be wearing those. And will you bring me those? Shut up. <laughs> oh my god, guys. Welcome to Paris. Mom, there better be other shoes in there. So where to God. <laughs> okay, guys. So this is the first... Um, Can I make them too, please? Destination of our two-week Europe trip. Um, this is how it's going so far. The first literal hours here. She, Emily, you put it in your maleta. You put it all in your maleta. See if they're there. You told me they were there. Stop screaming. Stop screaming. Stop screaming. Stop screaming. I literally can't live there right now. She tells me they're in the backpack, and then she's like, "You better not only bring these. I don't even want to see you bring these." She takes all my shoes out and brings these. Shh! Look at those apartments. I can't. You packed them there. Shut up. Why are you looking at mine? It's not in mine. No sé qué mierda yo ando buscando. Mom, you're going crazy. Pa, recoge eso del medio, ¿viste? Oh my god, you're going for everybody but yourself. You need to focus on yourself. I didn't do that on purpose. Ponlo con la esquina. Ponlo con la esquina. Ponlo con la esquina. Ponlo con la esquina porque aquí esto es muy apretado. There's too many things everywhere. I'm like, put your shoes under there. Sí, hay que acomodar, porque no se puede andar en esta apretación. No. Pero no puedo estar en esta apretación. Oh my god. Okay. You are doing too much, Mom, right now. You're actually going crazy. I'm laughing at you, bro. You're going crazy. Guys, we're all struggling. This is the reality. I'm gonna say we're in Paris and everybody go, we. Ready? We're in Paris. We. we. No, mom. <laughs> we look more enthusiastic. Okay. We're in Paris. We. we. Mom. <laughs> Today and tomorrow. Literally, so I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna close this. Okay. This is our room. Literally four by four. But you know, it's so gonna have to big. do for the next forty eight hours. It's so big. I have no idea what to wear. I know I just said that I wanted to wear something dark, but I changed my mind. I'm gonna wear something <laughs> nice. I'm gonna wear my White dark, linen pants. Because I feel like I like linen vibes. Like that's like the vibes I'm going for. Like I don't look good in dark clothes. So we're gonna wear my white linen pants and this little like tube top looking thing that's also linen. I don't know if that's gonna be a cute vibe, but that's the vibe that we're going for. So let's see if it works. Okay guys, I just finished showering. This is how the outfit looks, super cute. Right now, I'm going to redo my makeup 
and figure out some jewelry and stuff. And also try to figure out what shoes I'm gonna wear because I don't even know what shoes she brought me. Because I packed all uh, the ones I wanted to, but she's like, no, you're not gonna wear these. So she took them out without me knowing. Like, excuse me? So yeah, this situation is very nice. Also, um, <laughs> I was taking off my makeup and the little travel size thing that I brought for it, I dropped it and it broke. So I don't know what I'm gonna do because it might spill and stuff. What is this? This is you don't brush your hair with this. You comb your hair. Yeah. Duh. Why didn't I think of that? You don't brush your hair with this. Here is like the before makeup. Well, this is no makeup, but here's the before. I'm gonna do my makeup, add some jewelry, and then I'll show you guys. Okay, guys. I was. Um, we have a little situation with my jewelry. I changed my earrings, which they're super cute, but everything else. In a big knot. Yeah, so we're gonna use Allison's jewelry. Don't mind my dad snoring in the background. Okay, guys, here's the finished makeup look. And right now, Allison brought this cute little bow that we're gonna put in my hair. And I still don't have shoes. Okay, right, so I think I'm gonna go, I'm gonna loosen this and flip it through so you can't see the hair tie. Okay guys, here's the finished outfit and there's the hair. And I'm left with these shoes because my mom officially took all my shoes out. She confirmed it. We are going to the train for the first time in Paris. We don't know what we're doing. Let's see if we do it right. 612. Wait for me guys. They have a store here. Which way? Oh, we have to buy the ticket. Oh, and coffee, Rafael. He was looking for coffee. We bought the ticket for the train. Now we're looking the map and let's see if we can make it. She said, go there. Here, this is one that Four and. So we, this, we, okay, so we're right. Okay, we have to we're stop. We're here, so we have one, two, three. three. And, and then, then we, seven. And then seven to the next stop. It's the green one. So it's one, two, three, four, five. Maybe she come. I don't, we will see. I think we'll figure it out because everybody's going to be getting off. You don't know that. Let's just have coffee. Oh, Rafael is drinking coffee and he bought oh a cinto here. Belt. <laughs> a belt. Ready? We did it. We are excited. Train in Paris. I love Emily's outfit. Look. Emily's in Paris. Ay, ay, ay. Alison, check which one the four, no? Four. Oh my God. Mira, how fast. <laughs> so, four and three stop. Okay, go. Okay, we don't share We did the first stop. Now we're looking for the second one. And hopefully we're doing this right. I'm scared now on our way back if we do it right. Because for this way, people told us. But on our way back, it's gonna be night. And I don't know if people speak English, so let's see. Oh, mira, you're cool. Mira las gafas. You see it? It's right there. Oh! Right there, guys. Pay attention. We made it. This is so cool. The traffic is crazy, so if you come, it's better use the train. It was super fast and easy. We are here taking pictures and look how beautiful. Rafael, enjoy the moment. Rafael is in Paris. I am. I need a coffee. Okay, I'm gonna do the tour now. What is this? Oh, reservation only? Oh, maybe it's closed, but I see people going in there, so. Today is closed, tomorrow is open, but I don't know if we're gonna come back tomorrow because I don't know if I would like to go on top of this. Time to show. I have to buy something from here. Yes. Oh wow. We promised. That was really nice. We should actually get Lost in Paris. We are looking yeah, what to do next, it. guys. The weather feels amazing now. Before it was so hot, but now it's like chilly, refreshing, amazing, and it's 7.40. And look how bright it is outside. Yeah. Look how cute it is. Would this one better? Oh, no. yeah, I'll come back. I'll come back. This was the one. Oh, it's not one of them. <laughs> she wants something that is that I love Paris. 
But no sweater is hot. Alison, mira, hay una pila. Do we like it? Yes or no? We we oh no no. No no. No no. Look at this one out. Here you can find your name, but they don't have Emily or Alison. Emilio. But no. Oh mira George. My dad names. Love I think this one's better for Uriel because it's like more unique. She's gonna buy this bracelet. Matching for me and my friend. For her friend and for herself. So cute. Oh, it smells good here. Emily's looking for macarons. Oh, esto es para hacerte la ensalada. Bread. Fruit for Emily. Oh, thank you. Caesar salad. Onion soup. Salmon ceviche. Oh, Emily, that is good. Gelato. Mira de coco. Café. Tiramisu. Brown food. Emily, which one? First gelato in Paris. Oh, this one is tiramisu. Let me try the tiramisu in Paris. Mm. Oh, it's falling. I got caramel in a cone. Guys, 9 12 p.m. and look this it sky. Like, it's like 9 o'clock at home, I'd be in bed, pitch black outside. Uh huh. And it's here, like everybody's out having the best time. We just ate gelato, gelato, and what Allison. Time is it for them in Florida, it is. Three, it's only 3 o'clock for them. Yeah, but for us it's 9 o'clock and we have been walking for 20 minutes. I since we got off that flight. Yeah, right. I did, in the car and in the hotel room. Alison, until when are we going to be walking? Yeah, we have been walking like bobos for all Paris. Looking for I don't know what. Look at this. 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 Oh my god, we were eating there and we you have been walking around the circle because she doesn't know how to read direction. Yeah, we have been walking like crazy. More than 10,000 steps already. She make us walk just to be eat, just to be in front of this that I don't see any different from where we were. I don't get it, but okay, let's do it. At least I'm burning the calorie of the gelato, the pasta that was amazing, the bread, the cheesecake, because Emily gave me half of the cheesecake. So, where are you going? To the toilet outside? You wanna go to the toilet, like the construction? Rafael, that's close. Mira, tiene cerca. Oh my God, he wants to use that toilet. Let's see if he can make it. I told you, honey, boo boo, is closed. I told him, why you don't use the bathroom when we are in a restaurant? No, he just left the restaurant and he said, I need to use the bathroom. Too late. Alison! Wait. Crossing the street because look, everybody's sitting there waiting for the light. Oh, mira pa' allá. The whole thing over there is full of people waiting for this moment. Oh, mira el sunset, Alison. Yelling at me because every time you guys yell at me after I give you guys a huge detour, you guys end up loving the place. I know so, it's no amazing. I need to take a picture here. We have a wedding in front of us, and they're gonna eat pizza there. So romantic with the sunset and the Eiffel Tower. I think they just got married. Raphael just bought a bottle of wine to drink. And Alison is taking picture of him. <laughs> Emily eating macarons. And Paris. We are still waiting for the light. And guys, it is. Oh, it's dead, but tell me. 10.03 p.m. And look, this sunset is still on. I don't know until when. We are tired and she was gonna go to bed. And she wants to see the light. So we are waiting and waiting. You wanna see it too? Not really, I'm just gonna be in my bed. Mm. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. I'm gonna try on Allison's shirt to see if she got a too small of a size or what. 10 14, still light. 
Oh, all, all the makeup is on the... Okay, it literally fits her perfectly. So it's gonna fit me. Yeah, no, it's, no, 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 like it's a little loose, so then there'll be like a baby yeah. to you. Yeah, like that's the, that was the goal. Wait, where's her? Wait, smile. Mira, está Shut up. Keep scaring me, because then I like think I blinked and missed it. Guys, we couldn't wait. This is gonna lie at 11 and it's 10 30 and we are tired, so we're leaving and we asked for an Uber. So basically, we just got back. It's literally 11. Now yeah, it's. Yeah, it's literally probably going right now, but we were just so exhausted. Like, we were traveling all day, so we just couldn't do it. Like, we wanted to, and we waited like an hour, but it was just. You have to wait for like the sun to go down. And, it and it went. To be completely dark. Yeah, it's like supposed to be. But the sun was setting dark. for like two Forever, hours. bro. It literally took like three years for the sun to go down. I'm not kidding. Right now, we're discussing our outfits for tomorrow. So I'm gonna show. And our plans for tomorrow. Yeah, so tomorrow we just wanna go to like all the museums, like the Castle of Versailles, like those typical Paris touristy things during the morning. And then, I don't know. We have to get back to the oh, room Oh, we wanna do a early. boat tour, right? Maybe, we might do a boat tour. But we are gonna come back to the room semi-early because we have to be up at 4 a.m. Well, we have to leave at yeah. like 4 a.m. 4 30. So that means yeah. We have to well, we need to pack. We need to pack the night before so that we just wake up and leave that morning. Yeah. So right now, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna do with my hair tomorrow. I think I'm gonna do. So basically, I haven't told even Emily yet because I was gonna surprise her. So basically, I brought these hair accessories. So what I'm planning to do. So I got hoops and then I got these. And you put them in your hair when you have braids. So I'm planning to just do like braids in my hair, like probably two. And then put these clips in them. Like Wait, what? I was not listening. Like make a braid like down the side of my hair. Mm -hmm. And then put these like in like different parts of the braid. Or like these ones. Yeah. With my long white maxi skirt. And okay. I don't know what Guys, to do. for yeah. my cleanser, I had to put it in this little travel size container. Which is kind of spilling a little. So is mine. It's okay. Mine's it's literally like. Whatever. Exploding. So We're all on the same bus. I didn't even take my mascara off good, but it's whatever. Okay, I'm ready to take my makeup off. I have so much like mascara on right now and I haven't worn mascara in like a minute. So my Same. hair is I just like we I've just been at home the last couple of days, so I just don't do anything. Oh my gosh, my hair is actually really greasy. But I don't know. I don't really know what other like okay, so you wanna do the glass one tomorrow? Yeah. Okay, I don't even know what that's It'll called. It'll be cute for pictures. Yeah, it's like really exam. Do the point, yeah. I wanna go see the Mona Lisa. That's in there. It is? In that one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Then let's just do that. And I want to go to the Castle Versailles first. So we'll do that in like the morning. Oh my god, this is literally not going to come off. I put so much on. I'm scared for our next flight. Because like we got away with our big backpacks and stuff mm -hmm. this flight. But, but we're flying a different airline and stuff. It's so. easy, easy jet. I don't know if you guys have ever flown on that. I feel like it's like the spirit of Europe. Because it was really cheap. But it was like, it's literally well, it's like... Was French B or whatever? Cheap? Yeah. Well, it was like the cheapest option. That's why we came to Paris, really, because it was, we like, the easiest. just all the cheapest things. Yeah, because, like, what's the point of spending so much on a flight? Like, yeah. it's literally miserable anyway. Yeah, I hate whatever flying. you do, it's gonna be miserable. Yeah, so we chose French B, and there's, like, a certain measurement for backpacks. And I know that ours do not fit those measurements, like, at all. So I'm really just hoping they, like... We just gotta sneak past them. Yeah, we just gotta, like, run. Be like, oh my gosh, look, run. Because I really don't want to have to, like... Oh, what is that over there? deal with that because i know that it's just gonna be too much too much work and it's also gonna be like five in the morning so no no thanks yeah. not trying to deal with that when we land the day after tomorrow oh, in italy we have a two hour drive which is gonna be great and apparently there's only one road on the mafia coast so it's literally gonna be like bumper to bumper mafia coast mafia a mafia a mafia i think that's like guys my lips have been so chapped so i need to put a lot of this on and my moisture, is this moisturizer? No, this is my cleanser. It's broke, like the bottle's broke, so every single time it's gonna spill everywhere, all over my stuff. It's just so lovely. So I'm trying to like keep it straight up so that it doesn't spill, but it's literally gonna spill. And guys, we obviously, or is it? Obviously had to bring my eyelash serum because- I'm actually obsessed. I gotta keep these lashes long. <laughs> 
we are gonna be here for quite a bit of time so i'm so excited for like i'm actually really happy so far like everything's okay today no, has felt that. so long <laughs> Yeah, it has. I feel like I've lived seven lives today. Literally. Being on the plane, like, I literally felt, like, so not real. Like, I think I wasn't alive. No, I think it's just because, like, um, since the sun, like, the sun literally just now set, and it's, like, 11 o'clock. Yeah. It just got dark, so it made it feel, like, extra long. Yeah. Which is honestly pretty Like, the days here are so long. We got here at noon, and, like, I feel like at home, noon just means, like, okay, we the day's almost We started to go out at, like, 3. No, 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 we, we, got, no, we got our in our hotel room at 3. We left the room to at go out six. at 6. And we got back at 10.30. Yeah. Which, uh, no, no, we got back at 11. Yeah, so like... I just and it felt know. like forever. But yeah. it like good. But it's, yeah, it's good because you get to experience so much. So today we kind of just wandered. But <laughs> I think it was so pretty. Like, I had never been like fascinated with the Eiffel Tower. But it's always something that you like know about. Like, everybody knows what the Eiffel Tower is. And like seeing it in person is like... Wow, like I actually didn't think it was like that pretty and that big and like it's just huge Like when you turn a straight and you just see that you're like Like it's so pretty. So um, I really enjoyed that today. Like the first time I saw it on the train I was like, oh my gosh, that's actually so pretty today was a good day Let's we're gonna rate every single day at the end of the day. So today was travel be honest yeah, we're gonna be honest I, Today I give like with the plane and everything. Yeah I give it a six, but without the plane, I'd give it an eight. Okay. So with the plane, I'd probably give it a seven because I don't know. It went by fast, but at the same time, I feel like I dreaded every second of it. But then I also like don't remember much of it, but like, I don't know. It was a seven. But then without the plane, if we had just counted like being here, I enjoyed it a lot. I think it was really fun. And I love exploring like cities because there's so much to see. Like usually when you go out to like nature and like tropical places, it's not like there's a ton to see. Like you're seeing everything in like one look, but like in the city, every street you turn is like something new. And there's so many like restaurants here and like so much stuff. And it's just so fun to look at everything. It's like New York City, but like, even cooler but the only thing i don't like here is like people are kind of judgy and then i just feel like hecka judged because like people know that you're a tourist especially since we're not staying inside like the city city like where the eiffel tower and stuff is we're kind of staying a little far away it's like in our area nobody here is a tourist like everybody's like actually living here so us walking around in our fancy clothes we look stupid so that's my only little complaint is that some people are kind of judgy but that goes for everywhere. So it's not really. Oh my gosh, guys. We need to tell you what happened today when we were waiting for the Eiffel Tower to sparkle. Oh, I have the clip of it. It was so bad, guys. Okay, so. No, but no fighting at the beginning when they were happy. Yeah, when they were. <laughs> okay. okay, so basically we were sitting there in the little garden part of the, in front of the Eiffel Tower okay. waiting for the sparkle and like during sunset. And we saw this couple, they were like in a wedding dress and like just, you know, like wedding attire and like they looked like they were just had gotten married or whatever. So they had sat there with a bunch of, not a bunch of their friends, there was like three friends and they had like a bunch of pizza, they had like a photographer, everything. It looked like they had just like took in their wedding pictures or whatever. So they looked all happy, whatever, okay? And then like we're sitting in front of them and the girl starts crying and it's like the three girls, yeah, the three girls, the three girls and then the two boys in the back so like their couple was not together so then she starts crying and we're like oh my gosh she's Such crying a noisy no it's nosy you mean noisy yeah noisy. so she starts crying and then anyways so she's crying and me and my mom noticed because we're like the most nosy people alive we're like oh my gosh she's crying and he's like not even paying paying like any attention to her like he's just talking to his guy friend and she's just like crying so then we end up moving because we wanted a better view and like we didn't want to sit on the grass anymore. So we move to like where the fountain is, like where there's like concrete or whatever. We turn around and the guy was being held back by his guy friend because he was like like Angry. yelling at the girl, like being like blah, 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 blah. Like Emily, reenact it. Come here. Try to push me back. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Are you I'm, gonna the, I'm the guy. guy. I'm the guy. And she's like, yeah, 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 yeah. and we're like, but it oh, was like well, thirty minutes. No, it was yeah. so long, and the he girl was, was just sitting there, like looking at the crying, like, crying, and crying, and crying, and crying. And the guy was just like, blah, 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 blah. and the other guy was just trying to hold him back. It was 
forever. I swear, guys. So long. And we were just Lord, like, oh my god. And we were being so nosy. Like, we were like breaking our necks. Like, my neck hurts. No, my mom staring at them the whole time. Luckily, she had glasses on. Yeah, I wasn't even being this, like, disguised about it. Like, everybody was looking. Because it was like, there's so many people there. Everybody's, look, like, watching the Eiffel Tower. And then they were just, like, arguing in the middle of it. That goes on for, like, literally forever. So then they start, like, talking together. So, like, the guy calms him down. And then he walks back over to where the girl's sitting, oh, trying to, like, is apologize. That a movie? Is that a movie? Yes trying to apologize and then he like walks over like giggling like they're literally like he's acting like he's like 16 years old but he definitely is not 16 he's like probably like 19 or 20 and he walks over laughing and like giggling and trying to apologize to her and she's just obviously not having it because he just like made this whole show or whatever and then they start like arguing like they get up and start arguing in front of everybody and we it literally was right where we were sitting before so if we hadn't moved we would have heard the whole conversation but it was this whole big deal and he was still arguing with her like going like this like pointing at her like well, talking I, with his hands like, forever yes. and, like, screaming at her like literally screaming at her and then basically then the other girl that she was with like is ordered a taxi or whatever and she was like let's go and they got into a taxi and then the boys went the other way and that was the end of it. They went oh, separate ways. Literally married and divorced in the same day. I was like, oh my god. That nah, literally only got me through that whole nah, hour of life. I know why you missed the lightning. What do you mean? The lightning of the Eiffel Tower. You, it wasn't even you lightning. You were watching the movie, the, the novella. Well, it was real interesting. But like, we still had to wait another 30 minutes for that thing to go off. It was like so long. Yeah. yeah. We always like do that. We just are too lazy to keep Guys, waiting. You liked it? You can go out now, buy stuff. Now it's full of people in I the mean, lobby. Now it's like noon for them. Yeah, I yeah. told you, you're always it's like It's full of the restaurant, people hanging out. Yeah. I'm ready for bed. We have been up for way I'm too not. long. Dad, no, bye. He's going to be snoring in five minutes. We? We're going to discuss our plans for tomorrow. We're going to hit the hay, and then we'll see you guys tomorrow.